Hello everyone, so back by popular demand, we have a sorting my new photo card video. So as you can see here, I have quite the stack of photo cards to put away today. Um, there's also postcards in here, there's just a little bit of everything. So I've been saving these up for a little while, as you can probably tell. And uh, yeah, we're gonna put them away together. Um, I am dealing with a new setup here at my desk, so if I hit the uh, tripod with my chair, I apologize. I'm getting used to this setup, so anyway, um, I tried to sort these as best as I could prior, so um, yeah, we'll make it a nice and easy process, so let's begin. Okay, so first up, let us start with the GOT7 binder. Um, and let me find the photo cards that need to go in this binder. Okay, so here is my little GOT7 stack. They did just release a new album. However, um, I didn't quite pull the amount of cards that I need to collect, but it's fine. So let's just flip to the back here. Actually, before we do, I do have this present you card to put away, so maybe let's do that first. So do 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 before before this. Where is it? Here we go. So I'm almost done my JB collection here. I need, I believe, two more. Um I didn't realize that the pre-order didn't count as part of the 10. So there's actually 11 cards um, that I need to put here. So when I get that other one, I don't really know or the other two. I don't know where I'm gonna put that one lonely one. We'll figure it out. I might move this guy. But uh, yeah, we're almost done with the present you collection. Now we can move past spinning top. Da, da, da. And I have already started. I didn't even remember doing that. So I do have one JB. I pulled it in my albums. Um, but I know a friend of mine has another one for me and I have a Jin Young for her, so that is exciting. But for now, let's just pop JB in the slot and then we'll pop them in there. All right, one JB down, six to go. Um, and then I do also have these postcards. Um, they are a little small for the two pocket but i don't have any of those cool three pockets that fit everything perfectly so um i don't know if i'm gonna put them in here i've been thinking about actually getting like a separate binder or like muji binder maybe for all of my postcards not just got seven but literally every group because i find they take up a lot of space in photo card binders especially when you get this many so I'm not going to be putting them in here yet, I don't think, until I make that final decision as to whether or not I want to get a whole other binder for them. Um, but yeah, they are here. I got two different sets. I still need to trade for the two others. So I have this set that starts with this JB, and then I have this set. So if you have the other two, I have two more of this set that I'd love to trade. So there is that. So that is it for GOT7. So I'm going to put that binder away and I will grab the next one. Okay, so next up I have one of my favorite binders in terms of the way I have them set up and designed um, and that, that would be my Monster X binder. So as we all know, I recently completed my Monster X photo card collection. You can go ahead and watch that video. Um, I will link it up above. But here we have the beginning of Follow. Um, so yeah, we all know shit went down with Monstix um, and we've already kind of talked about it. We're not gonna go any further into it. All I ask of you is to please continue to support them and to fight for Wano, especially on Twitter using those daily hashtags. So please do that. Anyway, let me grab all of the uh, Monstix cards that I have to put away. Okay, so as you can see, I have quite a few things here. These are all postcard size items, which I am gonna be putting in the binder today because they're smaller. We'll get to that. I'm gonna do that last. Um, but first, let's do the actual album photo cards. So some of these are full member sets, which we'll also get to in just a moment. But here are the actual album things that I pulled that I will be keeping 
from um, the albums and then I do have a whole bunch of stuff to trade with friends so I'll probably be getting more soon so let's start I didn't pull a single Juhan card none of my friends have so far which is a little sad um, but I do have two of his ID cards which is fantastic so I'm gonna pop them in here let's start with this one Here. Ooh, nope this is more behind there we go and then we'll do this one over here and I'm uncertain what I left these two gaps for I'll look into it but um I feel like I need to make another filler slot or something oh I thought I had a do I have a bruise I might have a bruise anyway um so yeah I don't have any of his actual photo cards yet or his like, you know, whatever, non-ID cards. And then I don't remember what I wanted to do here, but anyway. Um, and then on the other side, which let me move some of these guys out of the way so they don't get damaged. On the other side over here, we have the Kihan page. Oh, whoops and I pulled one of his cards and my friend traded another with me. So I'm gonna pop those in there. And then another friend of mine also pulled one of his ID cards that we're going to trade for. So yeah, we're working on it. We'll get there. And then I do have a few other things for trade. I think I, um, I already traded my two IM cards with someone. So I will be getting a Juhan and a, another Kiyun for those, which is exciting. So there he is, two of Kiyun's cards. And then over here, looks like I started um, leaving some slots or preparing myself at least. So we have a spot for Juhan's standee, which I did pull, if I could get it out. But you know what? I think I want to switch it around so the bookmarks are on top and the standy. Oh my god, come on. <laughs> I can't get it. Uh, there we go. And then the standy's on top. So here is his, oh, sorry, the bookmark on top. So here is his standy, which they kind of stick out, but I'm okay with it for now. Um, and then I'm gonna stick his little bookmark up here and then I will get some white paper to put behind him eventually. And then we're still looking for Kihyun's standee and bookmark. And then I left slots for the lyric book, but honestly, I don't think I'm gonna put them in here because I didn't realize they'd be as thick as they are. <laughs> um, and they kind of need to stay in the album because of the slip packaging, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna take this out. Um, and yeah, so next up are things that I didn't prepare for because I'll get to that. Um, so we need another nine pocket. Let me go grab that. Okay, so here is a, another nine pocket sleeve. Now the two things that I need to put in here are um, the G Market pre-order exclusive cards. That's one set. And then I also have their Kino full member set to put away. So that'll probably go on a separate page later. Um, let's see, I don't know how I'm gonna do it yet. I'll probably put a filler here and a filler there. That way it's all even and nice. So Shonu always goes first. I always do leader and then oldest to youngest. Sometimes the leader is not the oldest, but it is what it is. I just like to put the leader first. So here we have Wano. So yeah, I, wasn't originally going to get the Kino, but then everything that happened happened and I decided that I needed OT7 and everything that I possibly could get OT7. So that's why I made the last minute decision to purchase it. I never did an unboxing of it or anything and that's only because I ordered it after I bought the albums. So it didn't come until like after I did that unboxing. Um, and I didn't feel like doing a whole separate video for it. So it will be featured in my end of the month haul though. So you can stay tuned for that. Um, here's Juhan and his little beret. So cute. 
And last but not least, I am. There we go. So that is the G Market pre-order full member set. I will get some filler slots to put there. And then we need one more nine pocket sleeve. There we go. And we have the Kino full member set. I actually really love these cards. This is probably one of my favorite Juhan cards ever. Um, so you'll see when we get to him, but so cute. Um, but yeah, if I buy Kinos or anything that come with like full member sets for any group, I usually just keep my bias and then sell off the rest. But if it's an alt group, I 100% usually keep everything because yeah, it just, I don't know. You don't, you love them all so much that you just can't get rid of them, right? Like I can't be the only one. Um, so yeah, these actually feel thinner than the G market cards, which is funny because those are just a pre-order benefit. Whereas these are like actual photo cards that came in the Kino, but hey, it is what it is. So this is the Juhan card that is literally my absolute favorite. First of all, blue hair. Second of all, winking. Third of all, dimple. Like literally the best card. Um, so there he is. And then once again, last but not least, we have I am. I don't know why like some of them are winking and then the others are not. It would have been really cute if they all were. <laughs> um, but yeah, so there we have the Kino set. Um, and then now we have the task of putting in all of the Kino postcards. There are so many of them. Um, so yeah, let's do that. There we go. So we're going to need some four pocket sleeves for this. So let's pop that in there. And now oops, these are definitely all out of order. So let me figure that out quickly. So here's Shonu. Okay, I think they're not that out of order. So we'll pop Shonu in first. Oh, it kind of sucks because there's three per member and this is a four pocket sleeve. So don't really love it, but I'm not here to waste pages today. So next up we have Wano. I'm probably going to put white sleeves behind this because they're not quite big enough to fill the whole um, slot and we all know that I don't like to be able to see behind or to be able to see through my pages so yeah we'll be filling that in eventually there we go so that is page number one I can get that more centered let me let me make some room Okay, and then we need another four pocket sleeve. There we go. So we can continue. And yeah. I really love these um, postcards. I wasn't expecting the Kino to come with so much. Like I knew that there was a postcard set and that there was a photo card set, but I don't know if I realized there was this many postcards, but I'm not mad at it. So there we go, Young Wan. I kind of hit the tripod, sorry. As mentioned, still getting used to this. So Juhan, get another four pocket sleeve. There we go. More Juhan. Where's the other I am? Uh oh. Did I lose him? Where'd he go? Oh, I found him. There he is. <laughs> um, so we'll pop him in there. Then we have our unit PC, or not PCs, um, postcards. I don't know. Are they just photos? What would you call these? They're not quite postcards, but. And then perfection. I do have these two as well, but 
I don't want to waste a whole four pocket sleeve on them, so I might just put them back in the Kino box, although I love this shot, so I don't know. We'll think about it for now. I'll keep them set aside with my GOT7 uh, photo postcard things that I need to put away, so yeah. So that is Monster X. That is everything that I had to put away today, but there will definitely be more coming soon, so stay tuned for that. Um, and yeah, let me put this away and grab the last binder. Okay, and last but not least, we have this big, thick boy. Still need to buy either another binder or a, th a thicker binder, I mean, or another small one and divide this in half. I don't know yet. We'll see. But I do have some ATs to put away, so let's start with this um, page here. Can you still see everything? I don't know. I feel like... It wasn't cut off before, but now it kind of is cut off. Anyway, so let me find my ATs cards. Okay, so here is everything that I have. So firstly, let's start with the treasure cards that I have to put away. There we go. So that would be these three here. I am completing this set, which is super exciting. Um, so we have Yosang's other My Music Taste photo card. I wasn't going to collect these, and then my friend bought me this one. So I was like, well, now I need to complete the collection. <laughs> so that's where we're at. So uh, I also purchased Songha's because I collect him as well, obviously. Again, one of the most beautiful photo cards I've ever seen in my life. He is stunning. Um, and yeah, so let's pop him in here. Do, do, do. And voila, this page is complete and it looks beautiful. I'm so happy with it. Um, so yeah, and then next up, we have their newest album here, EP Thin. Um, I have these two Yosang cards to put away, but I can't remember if one is regular. I think this is a regular and this is a My Music Taste. Oh yeah, I don't remember. I'm just gonna put them in however for now and we'll go back at a later date and look it up and not make any fixes that I, I need to because I honestly don't remember. So there is the first card. And then I'll put this one here for now, but I'll go do my research later. I'm just too too lazy to do it now. So, yay. Then there he is. Cute. Okay, so it looks like I'm just missing two more. We'll get those eventually. Um, and then we need to add in a new page, which I don't know if the binder has room for another page, but we're gonna have to. So here is another nine pocket. Please fit. Okay, so this one um, is for the anniversary edition of my, what's it called, EP Finn. Um, so again, collecting both Yosang and Songha. So we'll start with Yosang here. Um, there's only four cards, so let me see how I feel like doing this. Um, that's Songha, this is Yosang. So I'm just going to pop them in the sleeves for now, and then we'll see how I feel like organizing this. So there is Songwa's baby. I, I am getting Songwa's adult photo soon. Um, I guess what I can do is Yo Song, Songwa, and then I can do these two at the bottom. Yeah, sure, why not? And then I'll put name plates here and then something there. Okay, let's do that. So there's that. Here's another set. I did buy two versions, or not two versions, I bought two copies of the anniversary album so that I could pull or have as many chances to pull my biases as possible. Um, and it basically worked. I pulled two adult Yosang, I pulled Songho's baby photo, and then I pulled 
sans baby photo oops and someone else I don't remember or is that it no that's it I don't know anyway so I'm gonna just put a white sleeve here for when I get adult songhua and yeah we're good to go so that is that page I will obviously update the filler soon but then also with the my music taste versions we got some postcards so let me get a two pocket sleeve here we go hopefully it fits uh, uh, there we go so we'll put a yeah, song up top and a song down here again I'll get some white paper to put behind it but for now there they are um so yeah we're almost done we have some one us to put away or just one one us card so here we go here we go here so my friend was so nice and got me Hwan Wung's uh, My Music Taste card. I didn't purchase the My Music Taste albums, but he joined a go for them and apparently got to choose a couple members and he chose this one for me. So yay, that is all complete. That is so exciting. Um, and then other than that, we're just gonna skip ahead to the back. Um, so this is my random itsy page, but now I'm going to have to either start a new page or I might just pop them in here for now just to save on slots and nine pocket pages. But my friend also gave me these two um, Everglow photo cards, which is super exciting. Um, I believe she is my bias, so I don't know yet for sure, but she's definitely a strong contender. So I'm just gonna pop them up at the top for now. I know they're not itsy, so please don't yell at me for this, but I don't feel like starting a whole new nine pocket page for two photo cards. So we're just going to condense for now and we'll move them later. But there we go. So that's that for now. And then last but not least, I have a couple of ace cards to put away. I know I have, oh, I don't know if I have any spot for ace just yet because the one photo card, one or yeah, the one photo card that I did pull in my previous album, I just have um, in my trade binder because I would like to trade them. But anyway, um, so I'm gonna move uh, Yesung up here for now just so I have these A slots. And then this is also Everglow, so I should probably put that with the other ones, but we're just gonna pop it up here for now to once again save space. So anyway, here we have June from their previous Undercover album. And then I have Dong Hoon's pre-order. I would definitely trade this to June, um, but I'm totally happy to keep who I pull for Ace, so we're gonna keep them in there for now, um, unless somebody wants to trade. And then I also pulled Wow's photo card, who potentially would be up for trade for June, but I really like this card, so I don't know. So we're just gonna pop that in there. And then I also have this tattoo set that came with the album, but I honestly don't wanna waste another two pocket page, so I'm just gonna keep it back there for now. And we'll figure it out at a later date. Um, but yeah, so that was it. Those are all the photo cards and things that I have to put away. I feel like this video is a little longer than I thought it was going to be. But um, yeah, if you made it this far, thank you so much for watching. I'll definitely continue with these as I see people seem to really enjoy them. Um, if you want to see more content like this, let me know. Anyway, thank you so much for watching everyone. Bye-bye.